What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back and guys today we are going over the best night filters right now pretty much and the new market crash, all the new content and all that good stuff in this video. Um, So if you guys are new to the channel make sure to sub it up, comment down below, it would be greatly greatly appreciated man. Um, Right now I've been eyeing down Chris Paul all day so I'm most definitely going to buy that car for 79k. Uh, I think he's a very good player, 99 defense, 99 everything pretty much and he has amazing badges so I just scooped him up for 79k. Uh, definitely a player in my opinion that will be pretty good um especially for only 100k man i don't think you can go wrong with this card um literally amazing card i've been eyeing him down all day we're gonna go over the market we're gonna go over these locker codes as well um so here we go man um this one is literally hidden um so i'm about to show you this code that i actually posted earlier it's kind of interesting man i'm honestly surprised that this code is like a thing very weird but we're gonna type this in you guys might not even know it some of you guys might but uh here it is man we're gonna type it in anyways hopefully we get some heat i mean we should get some heat um i don't know why my lights bugging over there let me fix that quick that should be better all right let's go um so see hopefully this code works i got this from literally an unknown place uh, I think it's like for flash packs or something, but here it is, man. Let's see what we can get. L two seven D seven D three. Here we go. Oh, the code is invalid. Okay, so scratch that code. You know what? We're gonna go to the website. We'll be right back as well. Make sure to go check it out. So that's the first code. Uh, season dash six dash radioactive dash DM dash TMAC, and obviously we're going for the radioactive pack. Which is going to be very hard to get. So we're going to land this all the way there. We don't want yellow. All right, got past the yellow. I would love the T-Mac pack. That would be phenomenal. And we're going to get the... Boom, we are. We're going to get the T-Mac pack. So that's huge. And uh, we also got this reward free agent. Ooh, this one. This is a reward for a diamond player. All right, so here we go. Reward diamond player, 50 tokens, and or a diamond consumable. So yeah, TB. Damn, these codes are long. What's the point of making these long codes, to be honest? One... S C T S. All right, that's the code. You can pause the screen if you want. It's a pretty easy code. Ooh, John Moran or 50 tokens. Obviously, I want John Moran or the consumables. So I'm gonna try to land it all the way to the left, and we did it successfully. Hopefully, we don't get John Moran. That's the one card I don't want to get. Uh oh, don't get Ja. I already have this Ja. It would suck if I get him again. Uh oh. Oh, looking good. Oh, 50 tokens. I'll take that. Please. Oh my God, no. Oh, we missed it. No yes oh my god wow that's such a l all right we got one more code we got one more code and this one is the the hidden one two seven uh la, 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 d3 all right pause the screen check it out that's the code and then here we go so this one is for a pack uh obviously the, the best one is the hardened one so we're gonna try to land it all the way in the left corner um that's probably our best bet Oh, oh, there goes that L. Oh, all right, the yellow one. That one is Flash 2. Sheesh. All right, that's terrible. Flash 2 doesn't really consist. So now we're going to pop these packs, and then we're going to go over to Market. Uh, oh, we got an Inferno pack as well. All right, let's start off with the Inferno, then Flash 2, then Tracy McGrady. Um, all right, a Ruby. That was expected. Jared Jack, Ruby. I think I have in my collection. Yes, I do. Um... Let's keep it going, though. Let's see what we got right here. Uh, flash 2 reward pack. Let's see what we got. Here we go. Can we pull some heat? Can we get a flash? No flash. All bronze. Um, so these locker codes aren't looking good at all. Of course, we got the jaw, right? And then the radioactive locker code pack. Guys, if I see flash, you know I'll be so happy. And we get an amethyst. You know what? That's a free 90 overall. I'll take that. It's not even a player from the set, but I'll take it. All right, it's time to go over to market. I know I've been talking a lot. I know, I know, I know. But here we go. First off, I want to look at Galaxy Ovals, and I want to see what Giannis's price is at, because uh, that's my concern. And he's at 502. Wow. Okay, I have him in my collection, as you guys can see. That is crazy. Um, so right now, um, the market is absolutely destroyed. Um, we're gonna go over some snipe filters and whatnot. Dark Matters, guys. If you could somehow snipe out a Dark Matter. Like, I'm thinking about sitting on this filter all day, every day. And also, if you guys didn't hear how to unlock 
the dark matter turk market or whatever it is the the, the whatever market it is Supposedly you have to play two games of Triple Threat online. If that is true, make sure to let me know down below in the comments. And I love how they have Julius Randle in there because I'm a huge Julius Randle guy. I'm a Knicks fan and I love Giannis. So, um, yeah, definitely try that out. That's honestly insane. I would love to get Julius Randle. And also, if you get that token market thing, I have like 245 tokens. I don't have a lot. I got to go on the grind. But, yo, Galaxy Will Snipe Filter around 80K is kind of going crazy. Not going to lie. Around 70 something K. This filter's going crazy. Since there is a huge market crash, this filter is obviously destroyed. But, yo, some players, I noticed some Pippins are popping up, or like 75K. Um, so, I actually scooped, I did scoop up a Scotty Pippin for around 80 or 78K, I think, or 80K. Um, I thought it was a pretty good price. Honestly, I'm going to play them. My team's honestly coming together. These Opals are pretty cheap. They're very, very good. And it's honestly pretty interesting. And also, if you guys are wondering, should you sell your cards? No. You definitely should not sell your cards. Very, very bad idea. Um, the market is beyond crash. Now is the time to snipe. Let's check out what Larry Bird's price is. Larry Bird even dropped in value, guys. Everybody is dropping in value. Everybody. Um, so if you guys did invest, man, it's not looking good. It really isn't. Now, I want to compare this Wade. All right, thank God. The, dude, the, this one's literally the reward Wade, which is kind of crazy to me. Um, they literally made... They should update the Opal Wade because that's not fair to me and to you guys. Um, that is how I feel. But right now, man, pink diamonds are going to continue to dip. You're going to get your Galaxy Ovals for a lot cheaper, man. Hard and all these great Galaxy Ovals, they're going to be cheap. And I didn't know Giannis is going for 500,000 MT. Wow, I got super lucky with that pull. I spent around 200K and uh, he's 500,000 MT. This card is literally cracked. Insane pull. Yo, Tracy McGrady is going to go down in value a lot. Is he still worth picking up? In my opinion, man, I think this Galaxy Ovals T-Mac for that cheap... I think he's a must-have, in my opinion. I think Tracy McGrady is definitely going to be one of the cards you want to have. Um, he's definitely going to be one of the most goaded players in the game. And I think for the price, you cannot, you can't agree enough, man. For that cheap, you have to go with Tracy, man. Tracy McGrady is going to be so key. I think you need Tracy McGrady on the squad. Most 100% definitely need Mr. Tracy McGrady on the squad, bro. For 200k, he's still goaded. I literally versed him the other day, and he smoked me. Now the Dark Matter's out expect some crazy stuff man that dark matter t-mac is untouchable the galaxy oval one is also very very good especially on defense especially everywhere but guys right now all the investments we made they're not looking too good not gonna lie um i think we're gonna have to wait for the market to most definitely heat up again because right oh that's a good one right now bro the amethyst everything is super done um jason richardson for 1200 is pretty interesting though like I said, man, when these, these packs come out, these cards will always be at 1200 or 1100 whatever. Once they go away, literally next week, they're probably not going to release Super Packs as a new season is here. Um, these cards will rise like crazy. So honestly, me personally, I'll probably invest in some Jason Richardson, some Clams, whatever. It's most definitely worth investing in these players. Um, they're going to go up. Amethyst always go up. They always go up to at least like 1800 So if you're going to make 500 per off 1100 MT, that's not bad at all. Um, you're only gonna spend 100k to make 50k. That's fine with me. That's literally oh, that's a good one Um, yeah, we're just sniping amethyst for now. I think amethyst investing is gonna be key Galaxy opal man definitely pay attention to galaxy opal filter. It's definitely interesting right now Um, you can put your galaxy opal filter to I don't know like 75k and mad stuff will pop up bro Pierce and Igadala might go up to like 80k if you get them for a the right price But uh, yeah, i'm staying around this filter. It's pretty interesting there's a lot of stuff going on. You might even see some Larry Birds. Chris Paul's, man. I think Chris Paul's a great car with 38 hauls, 19 goals. Definitely a player you want to pay attention to. And not only that, man, I've been seeing Galaxy Global Snipes all day, literally all day, just popping up and popping up. But like I said, bro, right now you most definitely want to focus on the Dark Matter. And, bro, the Dark Matter cards are definitely what you want to be paying attention to, especially if you get Kareem or Zion or MJ for 100K. That's just such a steal. So... I'm definitely going to be paying attention to this stuff right now. I'm not going to lie. I think Dark Matter Filter. Um, Pink Diamond Cheapest Filter is probably going crazy too. Mark Eaton is probably dirt cheap. Let's check out that uh, that filter. Man, look at this. Mark Eaton's at 9K. Is he worth investing in? Honestly, bro, for that height, I doubt he's going to be that cheap. I know he can't shoot, but like in, in OG 2Ks, bro, this card has been beasting. Only thing is, he has a 77 speed too. This card might be worth investing in. I definitely would keep your eye on this filter. Um, pink diamond cheapest is definitely something interesting, especially with how OP that Mark Eaton is. 
Um, Mark Eden is pretty glitchy if you guys played with him in the past. So definitely pay attention to this filter. I don't think he could possibly go under 8K. If you get him for 8K, I think you should be safe. But yo, other than that, man, that's all we got for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more content. Sorry for this long one. We're just trying to make some market talk, some market guru talk. And um, definitely, Pink Diamond cheapest, Ant is cheapest, uh, Opal around 70K cheapest. Not bad. Not bad filters. There's definitely better, but yo, definitely try it out. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Stay tuned for more content. Have a good one. Peace.